Ah, X-Files fans, you hear that music? We're only three days away from the return of Mulder and Scully, and I can tell you, to get ready for a few big surprises, we have an exclusive interview with the show's creator, and he's dropping some spoilers, and we are breaking this new X-Files down by the numbers. Scully? How important were the fans in getting this to happen? Well, if we didn't think they were going to watch it, we wouldn't have pushed so hard to do it. I think important, yeah. Their loyalty over the years is pretty incredible. What if everything we've been led to believe in is a lie? What if there is no alien conspiracy? It's been 22 years since we first met Agents Mulder and Scully. After nine seasons, that's 202 episodes plus two movies, it's time to believe again with six new episodes from creator Chris Carter. Originally, we were asked to do eight episodes, but uh, we had to scale back our series uh, order because the actors just didn't have time to do any more. Couldn't you be jumping to conclusions? I can't do this over the phone right now. Scully, I gotta go. Another number you're going to love, two, as in the number of spoilers we can tell you. Spoiler number one, Mulder and Scully's romance is over. I can tell you all is not well as we come back. Uh, they are no longer living together. They are uh, living separate lives. Spoiler number two, Chris has already written a secret third X-Files movie. I never even showed it to David and Jillian. It was really just for me to sort of keep the characters alive in my head. I think it would need to be a really big screen event. All this translates to big bucks, a billion dollar X-Files industry. Reruns alone have sold for $230 million and a commercial on Sunday's premiere will set you back around $650,000. The question is, will these six new episodes be enough to satisfy fans. We really have to see how we're going to do in the ratings, and if the fans are happy, I'm sure we'll be asked for more. I think this thing has a chance because Fox is giving it a great time slot. The show premieres Sunday night right after the NFC Championship game. Everybody will tune in, and um, of course, that is one of the top-rated programs of the year. They're making sure it scores a touchdown. Look at you. On oh, Saturday. Oh, 